Hello everybody, what is up and welcome back to a brand new video. I haven't done a sit down video in forever. Very good to be back and as you can tell by the title and see by my background, it is Christmas time. I am filming this in advance. So as you can tell by the title, this is what I've picked up for everybody. I wanted to share this with you guys so you could think about 2022 whether it's a birthday an anniversary just a gift that you want to get somebody or for Christmas as well so I know it's a bit backhanded but I really really wanted to do this for you guys because I have got some really great small businesses that I wanted to let you guys know about I tried my absolute hardest this year to support local or to at least support New Zealand businesses I might have failed because not all of these are from small businesses but um I did try my best I really love the small businesses that I did support so I wanted to let you guys no. So in no particular order am I going to do this. I've got lots of presents around me um, so I kind of just going to get into it. Super cute bags. I got these bags from Kmart. They were about a dollar to a dollar fifty each. So this one is for my sister. For my family in particular we decided to do a secret Santa. Our limit was like about a hundred bucks. Before that was even the case I did purchase um, both of my sisters few things and I didn't get them for Secret Santa so I wanted to include it anyway and I wanted to let you guys know because I really love the gifts that I got. My sister is actually pregnant <laughs> which I'm so excited for. Got this cute little um, romper from Posty Plus. If you remember in one of my videos uh, a while ago <laughs> now I said that I got something um, in Black Friday sale that was special and yeah this is the so I got the 6 to 12 months. Then to to go along with it I did get her something as well and this is from a small business and I am literally in love. Um, they did have a Black Friday sale and I had to hold myself back. So this particular small business is called Design. She does candles, she does decorative candles, they're not really meant to be for lighting but I think you can. I decided to get a little pregnancy candle like isn't this the most adorable thing you've seen in your ever entire life. I just love it. Now I did get something else from her as well so I'll show you that now. So I got my friend Sasha another candle and I think she's going to be obsessed with it. I'm I'm so excited for her to receive it. So I've just put it in this little like um jewelry box. It didn't come in it but I thought it was cute. So I got her a little paw print candle. Oh my gosh you guys it's beautiful. Um I also did pick up one for myself because I've got lots of kitty cats and I literally love it. There we go. Cute little koala print. There is another small business in here which I'm super excited about. So this one in particular is for Caleb's auntie. I wanted to do something a little bit personalized and something that was a little bit more her. So I decided to pick up a custom wine glass. Now it just says classy auntie. And what I did to make it a little bit more fun was I just popped a few chocolates in it which was so cool so i really love the idea of that and i also got her like her favorite wine go along with that so that's really cool this particular small business is based in the horophenol region um and she is called cardis creation also going on to another bag for caleb's other auntie and uncle the first thing i got caleb's auntie is this little cat trinket dish it is literally so beautiful you guys 10 out of 10 would purchase as myself for my for me this is from acquisitions we just picked up a super cheap auto gift card and then for both of them we just went to the warehouse and we picked them up some belgian chocolate seashells which who doesn't love chocolate on christmas day the next thing is for kayla's cousin so the things that i purchased are from the warehouse and Whitcall. So she's just moved into her own like apartment like she's flatting at the moment which is super exciting and she loves Harry Potter and I wanted to get her something for her bedroom. So I picked up this Harry Potter duvet cover set um, which is super exciting and I did get the approval from the family hoping that she'd like it so I'm really excited. And then also from Whitcalls I got her just this oh my god isn't this soft toy just the cutest thing ever so she's 
collecting soft toys at the moment. So she sent me a photo with all of her collection. She didn't have this bad boy, so I wanted to pick it up. So for my bestie girl, Chris. I decided to get her a digital print now I love my digital prints up there is a digital print and when you walk into my house is another digital print and I have talked about this girl many many times on my channel I support her I love her she's awesome she's my sister's friend she makes grunchies she makes digital prints she does silk pillowcases like she is just absolutely incredible I decided to pick up my bestie girl a, um, digital, a digital print um, of me and her at her 21st birthday I I love it so much, so beautiful. I do have a frame, it's just going into a white frame, but I haven't put it in there yet. Going in to my sister, Layla, like I mentioned, obviously we're doing Secret Santa. For my family, she's not my Secret Santa, but I'd already purchased these before finding out that we were doing Secret Santa, so I wanted to show you. I purchased something from a small business called Mayabel, and it is a honeysuckle bath bomb and it smells absolutely incredible. This is like one of my first ever presents that I brought for anybody. So yeah, it's the Honeysuckle Bath Bomb. I'm so excited for her to try this. My sister's all about natural things and she loves helping the environment any way that she can. So, and she also loves bees. So I decided that I was going to pick her up some candles and this is the, the like look at it, it's so beautiful. It's absolutely incredible. I think I deleted the footage of me opening this, which kind of made me upset because I wanted to include it. But yeah, I'm genuinely so happy with this gift. They smell incredible. Um, and I think she'll be really, really happy with them. Going on to um, Caleb's sister, I also brought some other things from Mayabel as well. I'm super excited. These are shower steamers and they smell incredible. As soon as I open this box, like, I just, I just love smelling these things. So I've got her like a little goodie bag as well. So first of all, I got her two things from the brand Essence. We purchased at either the warehouse or farmers. And I just really loved this because it's supporting pink, pink and proud. I'm not 100% sure what they were supporting at this time. So I just got her a pink scrunchie with, I think it's got a bow or a butterfly on the back. Then some clips, which I think was super cute. Alongside that, a lip care booster with coconut oil in it which is it's super cute too. The packaging's incredible. I got a few shower steamers um, from Maya Bell as well. This one is Revive, Clarity, Balance, and there is one also called Beloved. They were really affordable. So go and check Maya Bell out. So for my friend Sasha as well, I also gave her a cat calendar. Now this cat calendar is from Cotton On, which I believe is an Australian business as well, unfortunately. I did decide to pick this up on the Black Friday sale, but it is literally so cute. All of the cat pictures. I'm genuinely so excited for her to receive this. So all three of my my friends Christine, JV and Sasha are receiving something of the very similar sort and I want to speak about this a little bit as well. I decided to pick up some mason jars, $3 mini mason jars that you just get from Kmart and I decided I wanted to personalise them. I'm not 100% sure at this stage whether I'm going to do like lollies or chocolate or affirmations like quote of the day put them in here. But you think probably, oh that's a little bit boring. My little bro makes things out of resin. He's gifted me things before out of them and I think they're absolutely incredible. So I decided that I was going to do my mason jar and on the top of it I was going to add some sort of resin design because I really want him to start his own little business because he makes incredible things. He makes things like bookmarks, coasters, butterflies, bunnies, incredible, credible creations. He makes jewelry, earrings, sequences, um, key rings, like he's absolutely incredible. I just want his stuff to be known to the whole wide world. So this is also why I love filming these videos as well. You know, I get to support small businesses, also show you guys small businesses so you can support them as well, but also we can encourage small businesses that are no, not yet small businesses to become a small business. Let me show you the pieces. So the first piece that I have is this little bunny rabbit. Like how adorable does that look and it's like a, so cute and perfect this one's my next resin piece it's just like a little kitty cat like how adorable i just love my favorite thing is that the head is bigger than the body like i just i'm obsessed and then the next one is actually two resin pieces put together so i was so obsessed with this particular bear and then i was obsessed with the love heart they kind of just matched perfectly but they weren't connected so i asked him if he could connect to them and he came through isn't he just 
incredible. I love the colors, the detail, everything about it. Those are my three little goodies that are going to go on top of three different mason jars. Alongside that particular gift for my friend JB, decided to pick him up something so exciting. I hate personally, but I think he will love it. I got him a Nerf gun. Isn't this like just so fun especially in the summertime yeah and just something like playful and something personal i thought really went well together and complemented each other quite nicely caleb's grandparents now i'm super excited about this gift this is one of the first gifts that i got as well just really want to show it to you guys because i just thought it was incredible we just went to new world and got some turkish lights because his nana loves those this is incredible you guys so i also purchased things from mayabel as well for nana so i got her these like little testers so they're just so simple so cute they're just little tester pot but this one is a vanilla magnesium lotion and i thought this was a little bit different for hand creams she's obsessed with hand creams i just want to get her something little but something completely different i also got her a vitamin C body cream which I just love. I'm not gonna open them but yeah I just love the packaging. They're just so cute. I think they were like five dollars. Next thing is it's just from New World. I also got Grandin a cherry right. I just chucked in a few Furo Rochers as well from New World. Me and my sister also went to a herb farm event not so long ago and we made our own like body uh, hand lotion and stuff and we got gifted three things which was really exciting. So I just chucked in a hydrating overnight face mask i already have the big bottle of it so this is why i chucked it in here because i um use it and i really like it so for granddad i did buy off a new zealand website i'm not 100 percent sure if this is a small website but i never personally heard of it myself and it is the cufflink website um i'll like i mentioned i'll just leave it down below ain't these just so incredible they are beautiful i just put them on like where you'd get a jewelry thing from because i thought they looked really nice in the little box that i put them in um but yeah these are cufflinks um he loves horses he wears shirts with cufflinks all the time so i thought this was the perfect combo something a little bit different than what he's normally used to <laughs> like i mentioned a hundred thousand times we're doing secret santa so for my secret santa i actually got my mum which i'm super excited for i got her a few different things so the first thing i got was from a unikem and it is by the brand called Wicked Sister. I don't know if this is a small business because I have seen Wicked Sister around quite a lot and I'm not 100% sure if it's from New Zealand either. But this is a velveted weight eye mask and it's just in the color black. Now I thought A, obviously the packaging is really freaking cute, but B, my mum gets a lot of migraines from time to time and I thought this was really great. So I thought this would help her. I don't know if it will. I also went to JB Hi-Fi and I got her a tile. Now if you don't know what a tile is, it is something that you connect to your keys and something that you can also um, connect via your phone. So if you lose your phone, you can press the button on here on your keys to find your phone and if you lose your keys then you can press the button on your phone to find your keys. She is prone to lose both so I thought I would pick that up. I then also am going to be making her a little Rarotonga gift pack because she's going to Rarotonga next year and she's super excited about it so I wanted to pick her up some little goodies. So at the moment I all I've picked her up is just a mosquito repellent bracelet because every time we go somewhere tropical she always picks these up for us so I thought I would make her like a little cute packet. Now because Caleb is doing Secret Santa with us as well I will just show you what he got. He also got my dad. For the time being he's only picked him up the diesel perfume which I believe is what he uses currently. So I'm not 100% sure what else he's going to purchase um, that is up to him. Editing Whitney coming on here. I just wanted to give a quick like explanation I guess on why the video is like cut a little bit short. At the current time when I was filming all of those pre Present. I wanted to mainly do it so I could show you all of the um, small businesses that I had supported. A lot of the other gifts from here on out were either from places like the warehouse, farmers, acquisition, and all of the businesses that are still in New Zealand but don't need as much support. I just wanted to also include a few different things because by the time that I received like all of the gifts that I brought for everybody I had just wrapped them on the go so I didn't mention them in this video which I do apologize about. Obviously, this is still a gift guide for 2022, so I wanted to include um, just a couple of the things that we did also give. Some of the gifts that I also brought for Caleb's family members um, 
also included of a dartboard, some outdoor games, chocolate, gift cards. For my Nana, I purchased like hand cream for her, like a little elephant decor piece, really cute mugs. A really cool gift that I didn't mention in this video was for Caleb's dad. So I do have some footage that I'll include it in now. Essentially, we got a vending machine for lollies from Cotton On. So we put crocodiles in the vending machine, which is his favorite lollies. And it was just really cool. It was just such a nice little gift. And unfortunately, it wasn't supporting small, but it was still something so meaningful. Which I really love. Although this was um, mainly for showing you local businesses, I wanted to also include a gift guide for you guys as well. I will let you go back to the normal video now. For Savannah from Caleb. So I picked her up a three piece cheese knife set. These are all from the warehouse. She requested things to have when people come over. So she loves to make like cheese platters. So I also picked her up this really cool um, like wooden chip and dip. I think it would look so nice like complimenting the goal. I also picked her up another wooden cheese board thing and I loved how it was round so it kind of just fits in with the theme. That's what he got her. I literally like love all of the gifts that I got just because I did put so much time and effort into thinking about these and yeah like they're not necessarily all from small businesses but I still pride myself on a lot of the gifts that I did receive like did give um and I just love this time of year I just love giving I hope you guys had a great Christmas and if you don't celebrate Christmas I hope you have a great holiday in general a holiday break away from work go and have fun hopefully the summer is bright and beautiful thank you so much for supporting me this whole entire year um, I'm so grateful for we reached 200 subscribers this year which is absolutely incredible for me but i hope you guys have a great day or night review maybe and i'll see you all next time bye guys